One of Zimbabwe's most celebrated technopreneurs, Maxwell Chikumbuzo, has once again come up with a masterstroke innovation, and this time it is an embedded wireless power generator that uses radio frequency to power a television set. Chikumbuzo demonstrated his latest innovation to a ZBC News crew at his base in Harare, whereby a TV does not need the electricity connection for it to function. Yeah, this is our self-powered TV that we have uh, designed. The first in the world to have such kind of a technology where a television is powered with a radio frequency. So as you can see right now, I'm powering this television. Uh, so this is the first uh, television in the world that uses self power to say. It is all in one. You don't need to put it on electricity or on solar panel or anything. As it is, it is a complete solution. Behind the television, you can see that there is a microsonic energy device, this box. This is the device that is converting radio frequencies into pure energy. As you can see, the power of the cable was supposed to be here. On all traditional televisions, power comes here, but there's no power as you can see. The television is, it is working as it is. So in Lyman, I think this television is a, we can call it a, a self-powered television. It is indeed an exciting innovation that comes in handy for households without electricity and even so a relief to many in the event of power outages. Chikumbuso continues to fly the Zimbabwean flag high in the world of innovation and this latest offering will put the country's map at the forefront of technological transformation. Owen Mundova, ZB News, Harare. Uh, come on and get your sign. Come on and get your sign. Hmm. Oh, uh, yeah. My first question is Do y'all think this has already been done before? My second thing is. If this ain't been done before, kudos to that brother. Snap it up, man, snap it up. Kudos to that brother for being the first person to have self-powered uh, TV around his mug. So, you feel me? Uh, that's what I'm talking about. My third thing is, is he gonna be okay if he's the originator of this thing? Is he gonna be okay in the future? Cause I don't really wanna put it out there, but we know what happens when you start to, uh, you know, make inventions out here that's kind of taking food out of people's mouths. My fourth thing is, is the electricity company gonna approve this? Cause my thing is, look man, they got portable TVs out here. They got portable, they've been having portable TVs out here since I believe the 80s, maybe way before that, or especially the 90s, we know that. How this ain't already been done before? But we get it, we get it. You know, out of all the technology in the world, you would think that they would have been a, there would have been a self-powered television out here. Out of all the technology that we have, you would think that these cell phones wouldn't die so fast after we spend thousands of dollars on them. Out of all the technology out here, you would think that they ain't got to run off battery no more. They can just turn on and just go do what it do. Somebody around here still trying to make some money and this brother right here gets a snap for that because he is trying to find the way to get us out the trap. Yes sir, yes sir, yes sir. Let's give it up to that brother right there, man. Um, he need to run and go hide. Um, I don't know how he gonna get this thing off the ground, but before this thing hit the market, you best believe um, if they gotta get it from him, they are gonna try to get it from him by any means. We've seen this story happen a thousand, a thousand times over and over again because there's nothing new under the sun. A black person get out here and start inventing stuff, next thing you know they coming up missing. So, like I said, I'm not trying to project that out there. Let's just hope that this brother get his cut and nothing happens to him. But this right here is, is a game changer, everybody. Uh, how much y'all think they'll run for on the market? If they hit the market, how much you think they'll run for? And do you think it'll ever be a time, there will ever be a time where you can literally go inside your house, sit on your couch, and you go to everybody's crib and there won't be any more TVs plugged up to the wall? Do you think that'll ever happen? 
I don't think the electricity company is going to take that L. I think they're going to do everything they can to try to prevent things like this from happening. I, I, I do think that somebody them probably already had this type of thing invented. I mean, to me, I feel like it's a no-brainer. But uh, you can't tell me he the first one to, well, he the first one to do it from what we see. But I know a lot of people don't thought about it. Oh, for real, man. Too much technology out here, bro. But um, yeah, man. Kudos to the brother once again. Is this a scam? Or do y'all believe this? Is this fake? Is it real? What y'all think? What y'all think?